All right, add a user or delete a user from your um, from your BAS. I added this tab right here called user service. Or you can go right here on this little sidebar, go here, drop down config, services, and then you have user service right here, which you can go to user manager or by, by right clicking or just double clicking. Both are going to show this page right here. Um, here's your, the, please do not delete these two. I'm actually going to hide those. Um, but what you would do is you just add new, a user, click OK. You're going to give it an admin role um, for your building. Give it a name. So let's just say um, maintenance for, for right now. The uh, Right here for password, just put in whatever you like. I'm just going to do... Honeywell 911. I'll do the same thing, capital H for Honeywell 911. And then you're going to go leave this alone right here, but then right here for the nav file, you're going to click this. You're going to go to config, drivers. Actually, I think it's in files. There it is. So under files, there's the nav file, which brings you to the home page every time that that person logs in. So you have to make sure that you're giving it a nav navigation file for when it goes to log in. Um, everything is already preset for HTML5, so you don't need to mess with any of that. Click OK. And now you have a user. And then if you want, you can just right click and um, actually you can just double click my bad there we go so you can right click and remove it or you can double click on it bring up back up the page and make your changes as necessary but that's the simplest way to go about doing all this and then that way all you got to do is just come over here Double click on home, brings you back to your home page. After, but I, like I said, I've also put the user service right here for you. So I just wanted to give you um, kind of a quick video of how to add and remove users.